welcome to my channel. It's brand new, so you don't know me. <laughs> um, I found this booktube newbie tag online, and I don't know if this channel is going to be like a booktube channel or if I'll just talk about books sometimes, but I know that I will talk about books, so I thought, hey, rip off that band-aid, make a video, answer some questions. <laughs> so I'm going to answer these questions and hopefully you're interested. <laughs> um, yeah, so number one, why did you start this channel? Uh, good question. Um, I guess I'm starting this channel because I really like books. I always have, and I've always had a lot of opinions about them and not very many people who care. <laughs> and I'm tired of um, explaining the entire plot of a book to my husband just so I can tell him my opinion about it. Uh, so hopefully now I can um, talk to some people who actually have read the books that I've read. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> did that, did I answer the question? I'm not even sure. We're moving on. Number two, what are some fun and unique things you can bring to booktube? Gosh, I'm really, really bad at selling myself. Uh, I work in a library, so I encounter a lot of books. Maybe that's... Are there librarians on booktube? Maybe. Three, what are you most excited for about this new channel? I'm excited... Oh, hummingbird. Can you hear him? I think it's a boy. Boy bird. Uh, what am I doing? What are you most excited for about this new channel? I'm excited to actually say what I think about stuff and hopefully have some feedback from other people and have an exchange of ideas and have some, <laughs> some discourse. Uh, number four, why do you love reading? hard to explain. Um, I love stories and other worlds and learning about people and how other people think. Um, and I love kind of dissecting why other people do what they do. I feel like an alien sometimes. <laughs> so it's good to learn, learn from reading. Um, also escapism, a thousand percent. Uh, I think that's why I started reading when I was a kid, because my life, I grew up on the Canadian prairies in a small town, and it just was, I didn't belong there, you know, I didn't, I never felt like I belonged there, but if you escape into a book, it's like, you belong, you belong in the book, because you're, you're part of the story, you're part of what's happening, you're part of the excitement and the adventure. Yeah, that's why. Uh, number five, what book or series got you into reading? Um, like I said, I've, I've been reading avidly since I was a little kid, so I, I really couldn't tell you. I think that what got me into reading was actually my parents. I'm very lucky. I have lovely parents who always read to me and then with me when I was a little kid. So reading with my parents is what got me into reading. <laughs> it's very, I'm very lucky. Uh, what questions would you ask your favorite booktubers? How do you read so many books? <laughs> man, I can maybe read a book a week, and I feel pretty proud of myself if I do that, but like, man, life is busy. How do you read so much? <laughs> like, good work. I'm impressed. But how? Number seven. What challenges do you think starting a booktube channel will be the hardest to overcome? I think what'll be hardest for me to overcome is just having a channel at all, like not not specifically a booktube channel, but like actually getting myself to sit down and actually film videos and not just like think about it in my head all the time. At least that's that's the challenge right now. Doing it is probably going to be the hardest part. Number eight. When did you start reading? Um, I think I already answered this. I don't I don't remember ever not being a reader. Sorry the. Something's happening with the sprinkler. I don't know. Yeah, I 
I don't remember ever not being a reader. Uh, I started reading as soon as I could. Uh, number nine, where do you read? Uh, everywhere. Yeah, everywhere. I read while I'm eating breakfast. I read while I'm eating lunch at work. I read on my breaks in the break room. I read sitting outside. Um, I read in bed before I go to sleep. Um, wherever, whenever, however. I listen to audiobooks while I drive. Just all the time, everywhere. Always. Uh, number 10. What kind of books do you like to read? Good ones? <laughs> uh, I think my favorite genre uh, is probably fantasy. Oh, the sprinkler's off. Yeah, I think my favorite genre would be fantasy. Um, next to that, maybe sci-fi, but I also enjoy little bits of pretty much everything. I, I have never had like a huge bias toward a certain author or a certain um, writing style. It kind of just depends on what mood I'm in. So yeah, and any book, every book, all books, please. <laughs> um, number 11, which is kind of like a, a bonus question, I think, says, what does your book collection look like? Uh, well, as you can see, it's not here. <laughs> oh, maybe I'll maybe I'll film my bookshelf. I'll show you my bookshelf. It is not impressive. Um, I don't I don't buy a lot of books. I don't really have a book collection. Not really. I only buy a book usually if I have already read it from the library and I really liked it. Then I might buy a copy of it. And from my bookshelf, you'll see that. That doesn't happen very often. It's like a like five star books only on the bookshelf. So yeah, that's it. I think that's the end. I did all the I did all the questions, and you got to see some of the hummingbirds that hang out in my yard sometimes. Um, I hope you got something out of this video. I hope you come back and watch my next one. So thank you. See you again. Bye. Hold on. Hose is gone. Gonna do that later.